Hey, what's up guys, it's Flex and welcome back. In today's video, I'm gonna show you an easy method to tint your headlights. So what we're gonna be using today is tint. This is not like the window tint that people use for headlights and taillights. This is designed specifically for your headlights and taillights. The old style tint, they're like a piece of sheet plastic that you had to spray soapy water solution, put the tint on and squeegee out the water and it was really hard to basically manipulate because it was really stiff. You couldn't really heat it up a lot. If you had an air bubble, you had to lift the sheet up and redo it. And that tint actually makes clear parts of your lens look kind of brown. Whereas this tint, it actually acts just like vinyl wrap. It's breathable, so if you get air bubbles, you can just push on it and it'll go flat. You can stretch it, you can heat it, and it will give you a true smoke look. So if you want that nice smoky look that's actually a true black smoke, not that brown like the old tints, you need to get this. So in today's video, we're gonna be using the light smoke version of this film. You can buy the dark smoke version if you want a darker look, but however, for headlights, I recommend the light smoke, and for the taillights, then that's your option. I'll go ahead and leave some links in the description below to the product if you're interested in picking some up. Not to keep you waiting, let's get to it. So here's a roll of tint that I bought from Amazon. It's enough to do about three sets of lights. I cut some for my taillights and I cut some for my headlights. Today we're only going to install the headlights. First step is you want to make sure you're working with a very clean light. So make sure you go ahead and wash it with soap and water. Next you want to mask off the surrounding area of the light with some painter's tape. The painter's tape is gonna allow you to pull the tint up in specific areas so you can readjust it without it sticking too much to your car. Next, you wanna grab some 70% isopropyl alcohol and just clean your lens to make sure there's no waxes, no dust, no dirt, or debris. Now you wanna grab your tint film, pull the backing halfway, and you wanna align it as flat as possible on the lights. Go ahead and grab your squeegee and start squeegeeing from the inside out. Now pull the rest of the backing off and you want to grab a heat gun and you want to heat it up just so it's nice and stretchy and you want to pull it back over the rest of the light and try to get it as flat as possible. Go ahead and use your squeegee and lock it down and work it all the way through the edges. Now that the tint is fully applied, you can go ahead and trim the excess around the edges of the lights. Once that is done, go back around the edges with a heat gun just to lock down the edges. Now pull the painter's tape off and you're all set.
Well, there you have it. Another easy mod to give your car a really unique look. I hope you guys liked the video. If you do, hit like below. As always, make sure you subscribe, and I will see you next time.